Are dogs racist? Can a dog be a racist? Okay, this is a touchy subject. I, I realize where this is going, and I, I realize this can be really touchy. Now, it depends on your definition of racism. With my definition of racism, no. No, I don't, I don't think a dog can be racist. A dog is suspicious about things he doesn't understand. And a lot of people are suspicious about things they don't understand. A dog will be suspicious until he gets it. Like, as an example, when Cruz, we first got him, he was about nine months old. He was really suspicious of children. <laughs> These little people who walked around and made a lot of noise. He was suspicious and he barked. And he carried on at these children. Now, once he got used to some children and we brought him in and got him accustomed to children, got him used to how things were going with kids that they were okay, he became okay with children. He didn't bark at them anymore and he, he loves kids. I think the same thing happens with people of different color and races. They look differently than you do. They look differently than what he's accustomed to. Uh, he hasn't been acclimated to it. And he may be suspicious until he gets to know him. Heck, if he's only around men, he may become suspicious of women. If he's only around people with long hair, he may become suspicious of people with short hair. He is a very, very curious, suspicious dog. And it can happen. That doesn't make him a racist. He's not judging them on the fact that they're a different race or he thinks that their entire race are bad people. He's judging them on the fact that they look differently than what he's used to. And I caught a little bit of a flack on this in the video because I didn't explain it as much as I should have. First of all, I'm not a racist. And there's no way to prove to you that I'm not a racist. I, I don't know how to do that. You know, you can't use the, oh, I have black friends even though I do because that doesn't mean you're not a racist. But I'm not. I believe that all people, regardless of skin color, race, national origin, sexual orientation, I believe that we all human beings, that we all deserve the exactly the same treatment, the exactly the same rights, and exactly the same opportunities in life. I believe that in my whole heart. But dogs are different. Dogs, <laughs> they are self-preservation. They have some instincts left over in their, in their minds. And if you are different than they are, they are suspicious of you, and that's just how it is. So maybe in your definition of a racism, maybe the dog is racist because he may not like you because of the color of your skin. But in my definition, he's not. He needs to get to know that, that way that person looks. Um, gosh, it's such a hard subject. So honestly, I'm gonna have to think long and hard before I even upload this video. Because I know the, the touchiness of the subject in the way that America is right now. But I'm pretty sure I'm going to upload it anyway. Because I think it's an important subject. Um, I have talked to some of my black friends and they believe that dogs are racist. That dogs can be racist. I don't know. What do you think? Tell me what you think. Can a dog be a racist? I want to know what you think. Let me know in the comments below and... Uh, Honestly, if I've offended someone, I'm sorry. I don't mean to. Um, I don't mean any offense to any race, national origin, or anything. And I realize the subject matter is touchy. But racism is wrong any way you look at it. But dogs are a little more simple-minded uh, than most people. <laughs> and uh, there are simple-minded people out there who, who are you know, they're racist. And if you're racist, I'm just going to come out and tell you you're wrong. And if you want to unsubscribe from my channel, it's okay with me. They need to be raised around a lot of different races. In my area, that's difficult because we don't have a lot of different races and, and they're not very prevalent. When he first met one of my black friends, I don't think it's because of his color at the time. I think it's because it's just somebody new, but he got, he got really uh, comfortable with him really fast. But at first, he was a little more curious uh, because of this, this man was different. I should also mention that dogs pick up very strongly on their owner's emotions. If they feel discomfort or anxiety from their owner, they're likely to feel it and show uh, this emotion too. They actually amplify the owner's emotions. So a lot of this 
could be an amplified um, reaction to their owner's emotions that they show toward a different race.